that is called a lament for the innocent. We are lamenting for the innocent. I don't know if we lamented very well, but I promise you we'll try again next time. You know. uh, the next one we're going to play is called uh, Lockdown Jam. So this song was created when we were level five. You know, just dancing by myself at home with my kids, not knowing what I'm going to feed them with, you know, all kind of thing. Enjoy.
Greetings once again. I don't like talking too much. Somebody said they can't even hear me, so it's pointless. <laughs> uh, before we go on, Mr. Alfred Kamkiza on the piano. <laughs> Mr. Amaishi Ikechi on the, on the bass. Umlungwam. <laughs> Mr. Peter Oret on the drums. <laughs> the theatre, Linden. Thank you very much for having us here. And uh, thank you for creating a space of this magnitude. And uh, look here, man. Uh, we are very short of places to play. And uh, places, like, places like this won't survive with this, without the support. We're talking the, the support of Concertus A, who allowed us to be here. Uh, IKS Consulting, they allowed us to be here. They're supporting us to be here. Samro, Samro Foundation, who are, who are we, really? This is the sp sp space created for all of us to, to use. Constantly, thank you very much for the support. IKS, thank you very much for the support. Norwegian Embassy, thank you very much for the support. You know, thank you, thank you very much. Thanks to you for coming and joining us here and uh, making this evening a, uh, a, a success, if you may call it that way. Uh, once again, I'm Mr. African Keys on the piano. And Mayeshi Ikechi, Peter Oret, you'll find out about myself later. Okay. Uh, one of my teachers, his name was Brian Tusi, Dr. Brian Tusi. And uh, he, he happened to pass, away, to pass away the very same way, the same year as Rahir. So two of my mentors, two of my teachers, one year gone. So that is Brahu, that is uh, Dr. Brian Tusi. I remember when I did my first year at varsity, I was staying at his house, Brian Tusi. And that's the very same year I met Brahu at varsity. He came in as a visiting lecturer. So basically, I wrote it for him. It's called Dr. Brian Tusi, the song we just played now. And uh, remember, as Africans, we always say, when somebody goes, he's gonna tell the others that, uh, no, they are fine in the back. Look after them. They miss you. You know? So the next song I'm going to play is called Dash for Our Fathers, which, which talks to all those mothers and the fathers who paved the way for all of us in the industry for us to be who we are today. You know? So basically, that's what it is. It's a dedication to Brahu. And I remember the chorus, if I remember very well, it says Brahu. Brahu, may your soul rest in peace. And tell the others the same. Dizimals, Peggy, Lulu, and all, basically. Unfortunately, I'm not gonna sing today. I'm vocally challenged, you know. Wow. <laughs> <Next time. laughs>
you know, we've seen all the bad things that happened during COVID, but there are some good lessons that we learned. We have to sit down and rethink who are we, what we want to do, and all those kind of things. I'm very happy, I'm not sad to announce that we're playing our last song. <laughs> I will, of course, miss you, but let's exercise. You learn, you firstly, you listen or you look, you learn, and then you, you practice what you've learned. So we're going to play our last song. And, <laughs> and I really, wa really want to thank you, but we're going to play our last song. And once again, Mr. African Kizer on the piano. <laughs> Mr. Amaeshi Ikechi, all the way from Nigeria. And on the Dow Girls. Mr. Peter O'Red from, <laughs> from around here. <laughs> and I just want to expand on that. My first album, he played drums, he played piano, and he recorded the album in his studio while he was playing. So we're working on another one. I think we're done. Are we done, Africa? We're just mixing and mastering. It's coming out soon. So most of the music you heard today, it's on that album. It sounds better on the album because we had all the time we were for ourselves. And, uh, but look here, I'm looking forward to sharing that copy with you, each and every one of you here. <laughs> but uh, in case you don't have the one before that, please talk to somebody, talk to me, talk to Africa. If you don't have his, Peter or Red, or, or my issue, same thing, it's, it's you know. But really, on, the, on, on a serious note, we highly, highly appreciate you guys as our audiences. Because I remember what Africa said uh, somewhere last year when he did his streaming. He said, uh, one thing that we've learned in this whole experience is that we must never take our audiences for granted. We must never take our audiences for granted. You know, when we see you guys, I think, ah, they will come anyway, you know. But really, really, when you sit at home, remember, as musicians, we are also healers. Not like multi healers and other, but spiritual healers. When I play a song for you and you like it and it goes to your heart in whatever way, I feel like I've healed somebody. Or two, I'm hungry to, to play for somebody. I'm not just hungry for the money to buy the bread, but I'm also hungry to play for you to make you feel better. You know, it makes me feel better too when you feel better. So we're going to play our last number and. Uh, it's a number from one of our masters, keeping me a Gezi. It's uh, called Scullery Department. Thank you once again, Scullery Department. It's our version of Scullery Department. If you know it another way, this is our version of Scullery Department. Have a good night. Travel safe, drive safe.
Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. We love you. Africa Mkize. Peter Oret. Amayeshi Ikechi on the dial pace. Sydney Mavunza. Love you. Have a good night. Have a good night.